Consider the two-dimensional steady flow discussed in problem 4.1 in order to determine the streamlines of this flow. The first step in this problem is to decompose the velocity into its components. The velocity field is given by V0 divided by L negative x i plus y j. Two components. The component in the x-axis is given by lowercase u, which is equal to v negative v0 l times x, and the component in the y-axis, which is given by lowercase v, which is v0 divided by l times y. The goal of the problem is to calculate the equation for the streamline. To get the streamline, we use the equation that relates the derivative of y with respect to x and the velocity in the y component divided by the velocity in the u component. We are going to substitute these two velocities with the quantities that we have for our flow. We have negative, we got positive v0 y over l divided by negative v0 x divided by l. What is that v0 and v0 cancel and an l cancel? Therefore, this becomes simply negative y divided by x. So if we rewrite this, this becomes dy dx is equal to negative y divided by x. For us to be able to solve this, we're going to use separation of variables. For separation of variables, we are going to put each one of the variables at one side of the equal sign. We're going to keep y on the left side of the equation and x on the right side of the equation. So this equation becomes 1 over y dy equal negative 1 over x dx. Once you have put each one of the variables at one side of the equal sign, you're going to take the integral in both sides. The integral of 1 over y is going to be natural log of y. And the integral of 1 over x is equal to natural log of x. Notice that for each integral there is going to be a constant. Constant plus constant becomes constant, so we just simply write one constant. We're going to move the y and the x-axis into the same side, so we have natural log of y plus natural log of x, and that is equal to a constant. Using the laws of logs, we could say that natural log of x plus natural log of y is equal to natural log of y times x. And that is equal to a constant. Notice that a streamline, basically what we want is y as a function of x. So we're going to uh, solve this equation. And then that means that we take the um, exponent in both sides. This and this cancels. So we have y times x, and e to a constant is the same thing as a constant. Therefore, the streamline for this equation is simply y is equal to c divided by x, and this is the streamline. Notice that this equation for the streamline is a hyperbola, which means that the line is going to reach uh, asymptotic value both in the x and in the y axis. The value of c is provided dependent on the position at which you draw your curve. For example, if we take x to be equal to 1 and y equal to 1, we substitute those values and we could see that the value of c is equal to 1. Then we notice that this is going to be the path. So if this is the position 1, 1, so somewhere over here, this is the streamline that will be crossing in that particular point. Please make sure to go back and uh, do this whole process again. Make sure that you're able to know how to do separation of variables and be able to integrate properly to get the value and to get the uh, equation for the streamlines and be able to get the values of C depending on the corresponding point by which the uh, streamline is crossing.